I can think of a number of diseases that, that, I, that I deal with on a regular basis that I consider silent. The most common in the United States is obesity. Um, it's a silent disease. Um, it causes changes in our bodies that we're not aware of, and that's really the definition of silent disease. Um, another one would be essential hypertension. Even though we don't know the cause of that, it is, it is widespread throughout the United States. And if you don't go to your primary care physician to get your blood pressure checked once or twice a year, you'll never know whether you have it. And this disease can then do end organ damage uh, to our arteries of our body, causing strokes, heart attacks, renal failure, peripheral vascular disease, carotid occlusive disease. So it's very important to identify it, to diagnose it, and to treat it. Another common silent disease is diabetes, type 2, intimately related to our problem of obesity. But type 2 diabetes affects probably 40 to 50 million people in the United States, and another 20 who are pro million who are probably undiagnosed. Once again, a silent disease, you won't know that you have it until you come to the doctor and probably get a blood test, or he asks you several questions about the, the symptoms that you weren't really aware of, such as uh, polydipsia, which is excess of thirst, polyuria, which is urination over a period of time excessive, and, and weight loss. Another di type of silent disease is hepatitis. Hepatitis B and C are widespread throughout the world in the United States.